हाई गाइज वेलकम टू एस सी एम पीई और एस सी पी एम द वे दैट यूल कॉल इट एम सी क्यूज वी आर डूइंग चैप्टर नंबर वन दर इज इंट्रोडक्शन टू एस सी एम पी आर एम इज टू बी डूइंग एवरी पॉसिबल एम सी क्यू फ्रॉम द मॉड्यूल एंड वन जै थिंग इज ओवर वी आर गुन बी कवरिंग ऑल द एम सी क्यूज आर देयर ऑन द बोर्ड ऑफ स्टडीज पोर्टल ऑल्सो एंड माइंड यू देर लॉर्ड ऑफ देम दे आर अराउंड एटीन हंड्रेड एम सी क्यूज आर देर वी आर द ओनली इंस्टीट्यूशन हु इज डूइंग एवरी एम सी क्यू completely in detail with illustrations with examples our complete course already has entire course whether it is your practical questions or it is your mcqs or it is your theory it is your concepts everything the details are there in the description you all can go through that apart from that also request you all to join our telegram channel for the updates for the subject so let's see what we all have today The question is: Technology is dynamic in nature and has significant bearing on activities that create value for the consumers. Okay, your organization is considering to introduce RFID radio frequency identification as a technological breakthrough. RFID is capable to revamp which of the following primary activities to generate scope of the value? all there are five primary activities ica has mentioned four of them you have inbound logistics that is raw material is coming in outbound logistics that is the finished goods are going out to the distributor sales and marketing we all know the meaning of that after sales service okay so bring us options please options in this case three and four only those are the correct ones then uh, over here you have two and three okay then the next one you have 1 and 3 and lastly you have 1 and 2 think of the correct option at this stage okay so now what do you mean by rfid now these are like you know you all know about fast tag right fast tag is a inferior system if you go to foreign countries like under fast tag what happens there is a qr code okay that is getting scanned by a certain machine your qr code is basically a tag and there are readers okay but this is slightly a inferior system like you know your tag has to be completely in the correct place for the scanner to be reading it else you cannot be reading it right so many times you must have observed like you know whenever you are in a car and the machine is unable to read your qr code you'll have to like you know take your car front or back or a person comes with a handheld machine and he's trying to be doing it a better alternative to that you'll be getting in countries like us whereby whenever the cars are manufactured they are equipped with rfid systems rfid systems these are radio frequency identification devices which are fitted in your car so what happens in us like here even if there is fast tag there are still lot of queues that are there whenever you have to like you know go through those toll areas but in foreign countries it does not happen like that okay what happens is a very simple process in foreign countries if you'll go to us up and so on uh you will be driving a car it has a rfid system okay and before the toll gate comes approximately 50 meters before that there are readers which are there that's tries to capture the radio frequency of the device that is fitted inside your car and if it catches it will catch okay if it catches then automatically the gate that is 50 meters ahead will open so therefore your car is not halting for any purpose this is radio frequency uses and this is whatever helps you in many activities especially to you have inbound logistics inbound logistics vehicles of the suppliers are coming in to deliver the system so automatically like you know once the rfid gives a signal like you know that the vehicle has left from the supplier automatically you will be ready like you know that let's try to take the delivery of the raw material apart from that whenever you have to distribute the finished goods okay you have to distribute the finished goods to the distributors your vehicles will be going out at that time rfid will be taking care of this thing like you know that the moment your vehicles leave a designated area a message will be coming to you like you know that these vehicles have reached this area up and so on 
so basically it is used wherever transportation is there so therefore out of the four activities there are two activities that are greatly benefited by rfid systems those are inbound logistics that is raw material from the suppliers coming to our factory inbound uh, then the second one that is outbound logistics are finished goods going out to the distributors so out of the four options i guess one and two should be the correct ones okay so my bet is on d yeah that's the correct answer i'll see you all next time with new mcqs take care guys bye